There's someone underneath your bed. We're back. Fears to Phantom came out with a new game, Woodbury Gateway. Sydney Harper, a 23-year-old working at a consulting firm, plans a weekend getaway to Woodbury Rental with her college friends. Little did she know that she was about to unfold during their stay. Let's get to this. Oh, we're here. Okay, so we got to get a coffee. Frank, you still here? You stole me that lunch money. Oh, this reminds me of the office. Oh my gosh, I would hate to work in a cubicle my whole life. How do I, uh, okay, this... Yeah, it's like a Keurig. Oh, this is nice. I gotta put water in there. Uh, maybe I have to fill this up with water. I'm a genius. And then we put the water in here. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm feeling pretty good. I mean, this is this is gonna be a good game. I, I mean, I made a cup of coffee in the first two minutes. Okay, all right, R&B to sip. <laughs> All right, so I guess I'm here pulling the uh, the night shift. Need to use the restroom. Okay, so I have to use the bathroom. Ah, follow the signs. Thirty nine buried, zero found. Can I throw this? No, I'll just keep. I'm just gonna take the coffee with me. Yeah, I'm just gonna take a piss right here. All right. Oh, put the door. Who cares? I'm the only one here. Frank. Frank? <laughs> you, Frank. Yeah, I'm working late again. Yeah, go f yourself. Sorry. Clean that up, Frank. Asshole. Oh, look how the phone's ringing. He said I'm pulling an all nighter, so this looks like it's gonna be one of those games. Hello? Hey, Orp, it's Mike. I literally saw it said go for Sydney. I should have clicked on that shit. Go for Sydney. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Well, you know, it's the Everything 1980s, right? so my phone battery probably sucks balls. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> eh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, Mike, I've told you multiple times. You're just not my type, and red is not your color. Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting kind of late. Frank, I'm an independent woman. Damn, Art, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. I mean, if you want to talk about um, it. Um, about our trip. Did you get a chance to book the rental house? Oh, God. We wanted to see you. I forgot about and the rental. Nora. Uh, nope. You seem a bit annoyed about me calling. Seriously, Harp, if this is a bad time. Mike, come on. I'll do it now. That's the Sydney Harper I know. I'm sorry if I was being pushy. Hey. I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride together. It'd be nice to catch up. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Why could I not get a choice where I can say, no, I'll drive myself? Why do I have to be driven by a man? Ugh. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under $100 a night. Why don't you book the rental then, Mike? Why am I getting so upset? I feel like this is real. This is this is my life. Nora and I were talking, and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. I don't care. <laughs> That's a cool option. I wonder how I do that, though. I'm in accounting. <laughs> I can tell. Oh, I just... <laughs> Literally, whatever I type, it just types. That's pretty cool, though. I like this. Did it say feeling unlucky? Woodbury. I wish I could really type that fast. Peaceful cabin area. Hmm. Four star reviews, 11 reviews. Don't know if I trust that. Oh yeah, yeah. What is this? The Walking Dead? I think this is gorgeous. Yeah, this is lovely. Let's do it. Over the bu Oh, you gotta keep it under 100 a night. I mean, this one doesn't look too bad. I mean, there's a cellar, right? Over here? I mean, that, that looks nice. Yeah, okay. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consulting firm in my city. Life at the firm was a constant juggle of deadlines, client meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for a leisure, let alone a social life. Job paid well, sure, but at the expense of my mental peace, I'm Sydney Harper. One of my college friends, Mike, suggested that we take a weekend go to getaway to a rural Vermont. Plan was simple. We rent a small cabin, close our shift early on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Okay. God. Lucky for you, the view. 
Or doesn't have to. Is that a PSP? Hey, my boy, can I buy that PSP again? I lost mine like seven years ago. Oh, oh I just, my suitcase. I forgot my suitcase. Oh, there it is. Mike, is this you? Hey, Mike, how you doing? You don't look creepy at all. Hey, Mike, how are you? You smell like shit. Uh, I'm, just, I, I'm not gonna respond to that, Mike. That's a bit of an attitude. I don't like that. No, that's fine. That's fine, Mike. Uh, you you can you can do that all you want with my hugs. I don't really give a crap. Oh, I've got my suitcase. <laughs> uh, you scare me, Mike. Okay. There you go, Mike. Huh? Yeah, let's do this. Yes. God, my hands are so sweaty. God. This is why I like controllers. This is nice. Yeah. I can get used to this. This actually really is nice music. Harp, isn't it weird? We used to dream about escaping our college. And now we here we are. My acceptance tells me you're going to be the uh, freaky bro. I can tell. Yeah. Uh, I guess I'll talk. Oh, Mike. Change is just hard. Like trying to adjust to the new job. Interesting, Mike. Don't care. Mike, you and I aren't going to get along, I can tell. No, no, I don't miss college. Uh, cafeteria food. Why would you miss it? No, I don't miss it. Yeah. Wait, I was going to say us? Uh, Mike, I don't care. Pretend you're my Uber driver. <sighs> Did I miss something? What did I say? Yeah, it's a school bus. Maybe it's a project. It's just a school bus. Who cares? <laughs> That's cool. I signed him on wheels. That would be really cool to go into. How far is it now? Are we even close? Yeah, aim into that. God, this is so long. No wonder this video or this gameplay is two hours. Intergalactic space. Oh, yeah. It's like when the snow comes right at you. <laughs> Woo! It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. It's like Star Wars. It's awesome. It's kind of beautiful. No one cares, Mike. You're not going to hit on me. I'm an independent woman. Don't test me. Check what out? The car? Oh! It's a pizza shop. I'll, I'll get the uh, pizza, I guess. Operation Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Yeah, you're really attractive. You know that? Jesus. Go ahead, Mike. Men first. Go ahead. Because I can't do it for some reason. Yes, thank you, Mike. I appreciate you. Reports of a strong snowstorm coming towards Woodbury tonight. It's a cartoon. Residents are recommended to stay indoors and keep warm during this time. I trust that weather, man. I do. Oh, it's so cold out here. I, I can't feel my hands. Okay. Uh, Mike, you can order something? I guess so, man. Is this where uh, Fozzie Bear stays? Ooh, let's see. Do I cheese or margarita? Let's do margarita. It sounds good. Second slice cheese. We'll do a cheese again. Any drinks? Uh, that should cover us. Just a pizza for today. I want a water, Mike. Did he say six? Hot? I thought it was like two. What? Mike, you owe me $22, because I know I paid for that. I have a feeling I paid for that. Look at you, Mike. All just ready to go. Here's the rules. We're going to keep it kosher. We're not going to talk about dating. We're not going to talk about the past. We're just going to talk about the snow looking like Star Wars when you drive through, okay? That's what we're doing. That's the guidelines for tonight. I don't know how to... Uh... Aha! Uh -huh. Let me take a wild guess. Some of our friends probably can't make it. I, I guarantee you that's what this is about. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. Huh. Oh, this is shaping up to be a horror film. Yeah, I did. Just saw it. Of course she will. What is with that guy's hands? And who are you talking to? Jeez, right on time. God, jeez. I actually like how it looks like a margarita pizza and two cheese slices. That's awesome. This pizza slaps. You heard it here first, folks. And why didn't you eat the crust? I don't understand people that don't eat the crust. You're insane. I just said this. If you don't eat the, eat the crust, you're insane. It's gonna say it's kind of wasteful. It's bread. It's edible. And technically, so is the skin of an orange peel. I am not taking a hitchhiker. I'm not gonna take you with me. I'm gonna say no. 
No! Look, I said no, I'm sorry. You ain't too kind, are you? No, I'm not. Oh, he's walking. There he is. <laughs> Can I burp? Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, I don't know why I went cross-eyed there. That was weird. <laughs> Mike, let's get there out of here, all right? Just... God, who's in the way? Yeah, that was delicious. Yeah, give me the, give me the keys, Mike. I'm excited to drive. It's like GTA. <laughs> Can I actually drive? Probably not. Good evening, Vermont. Oh, I can actually drive. Host, yeah, Mike. You see how I drive? <laughs> yeah. This reminds me of like the 90s when like we were all kids and it's like Christmas time is here. And what's cool is that all this music is copyright free. Appreciate you, creator. I have no idea. Okay, Woodbury. Here we go. What happens if you go like left? Maybe it's like an invisible wall. Yo, Mike. You bopping, baby? That's right, Mike. Yeah, I ain't got moves like that. Listen, if you don't got moves like that, you ain't being with me. Just saying. Welcome to Woodbury. Home of nothing. I keep a ride on my side. Oh. Come on, Mike. Come on, Mike. Don't look at me like that. I told you. I told you if you can't bop, we ain't doing nothing. We'll be back right after this message. There's no commercial. Yeah, Mike. What you think about the commercial, Mike? <laughs> Oh, Mike, if I could teach you what they get to. I don't know where the hell I'm going. That's definitely it. All right, pulling this driveway here. Hey! Sorry. <laughs> I think I hit somebody. Oh, well. All right, how the hell I get out of here, Mike? Mike! Oh. I got it, Mike. Forget it out. Oh, Mike, Jesus. Mike, is that beer? Always drinking. God, Mike, you gotta get that figured out, bro. I'm glad we're not in the middle of nowhere. This is... this is good. That's a good sign. Oh, God, from the lockbox? Oh! Uh, I think I gotta go for the code. 5176. I hate being sick. This is the worst. Okay. 5176. Damn it! <laughs> there we go. All right, Mike, got the keys. My suitcase. All right. There we go. Wow, Mike, 100 bucks a night. This place looks like shit. Actually, it doesn't look that bad. Let me put this right there. There you go. How do I stock their fridge? Oh, wait. I probably got to grab the cooler. Mike came prepared. I could appreciate that. <laughs> Good job, Mike. Good job. Okay. All right. Let's see. All right. We're stocking the eggs here. We did a Costco run. We're Costco, guys. Sorry, I had to. You know who I'm talking about. If you don't, Silas, this is all for you. We're Costco, Costco guys. guys. Of course, we had to try the new double chunk chocolate cookie. Bake. And we're back. God, Mike, how much crap did you get? That's it, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, Mike, boy. There you are. Did you wash? Yeah, let me go pee. And you know what? I don't need your permission to pee, Mike. All right. Let me text Rick here. Hello, Rick. We checked in. Face smells like shit. But hey, I'll give you four and a half stars. <laughs> I forgot to wash my hands. Uh, whatever. Who cares? Yeah, let's check out the place. Can I wash my hands really quick? Yeah, I'm just wash my animation hands. <laughs> Sorry about that, Mike. Just whacked you at the door there. This is bigger than your apartment. Well, it's a home. Okay, it's not an apartment. I mean, an apartment can be a home. Oh! We have many... Moving on. Okay. Mm oh. <laughs> like the screenshot. You wanna play a Ouija board? Come on, Mike, let's play a Ouija board. You wanna play? Mike! Ouija board. Alright. Mike, do you blink? Must be astigmatism or something. Alright, Mike, let's go check upstairs. You go check your bedroom, and I will go check my separate bedroom. Mike, 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 Mike. We need to talk later, okay? okay. <laughs> oh, God. God. Oops, a daisy. I'm gonna about to beat the daisy out of you. Are you kidding me? You were looking out for your cat? That was not okay. Seriously, that was not okay. And you just stood there. Sure. This is a creepy room. What is this supposed to be? Like the preload? 
Thanks for showing me the shower. I've never heard a shower being described like that before. Two men walk into a room. A third woman stands on the outside, concerning if she should walk in the room or not. How is this a nice view? It's it's a view of some old, crusty houses. They look like they've people been murdered in. What am I doing? I don't like the way you two are standing here, just staring at me. <laughs> I'm nervous. Why is it that you can walk through a door, but I can't? Yes, I'm coming. Now, this is creepy. Nothing. You don't need to go in there. That's where I keep my slaves. Now, that's where you keep your dead bodies at. Let's let's be honest, because it's sure shit not where you keep the cotton candy. I was just joking. Uh, <laughs> it's just shaping up to be terrifying. Yeah, go find that damn cat of yours, Stinky Pete. Hi. Right. Oh, God. You heard that, Mike? He's talking to me like that? Mike. Yeah. Very weird. Fine, I'm gonna go take a quick shower. Where's the shower at again? Uh... Oh, it's over here? Oh, huh. here it is. Found it! Hey, Mike, it was like a waterfall. It really was... You left me alone in here? Sweetheart, I would not count on you to catch dinner. You look like you couldn't catch your own cold. <sighs> I hate fishing. Do we really have to go fishing? Oh my god. This is why we don't date. You do boring things. Mike, what have you been doing in this shed? Yeah, I guess I grabbed the other fishing rod. Where's it at? Oh, there it is. All right, Mike. Well, let's go. <sighs> this is nice. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Oops. I threw my fishing rod into the stream. Oh, that's good. Come on. There we go. There we go. You have to go like back and forth. <laughs> Did I get it? Fudge! It's probably the same one. Yes! There's... There's a man over there. How long has that man been there? Is that the... That's the hiker! Please be it. Thank you! Here we go. Yes! Finally! Get the hell out of here. Let's throw this out of the way. Throw it out of the way. <laughs> yeah, I don't even care. Mike, I'm gonna let you go first. I'm a little nervous. We left all the doors open. Marinade? Uh, sure. Just a lake bowl and throwing ginger pe I'm not gonna remember all this. Oh, okay, it tells you. <laughs> yes. Okay, salt, salt and black pepper. Okay, where's the salt and black pepper? Oh, here we go. All right, salt. Black pepper. I love how they do this. Okay, paprika. Where's the paprika? Uh, no, that's ginger. Well, I need that too anyways, don't I? Okay. Paprika. Italian seasoning. I'm assuming that's what that is. Very nice. Olive oil. Where's the olive oil? Mike, I actually like cooking with you. Ah, yogurt. Oh, olive oil. Aha! Two carbs, marmalade, and veggies. Okay, let's just... So, we need to fish. One. Two. Okay, marmalade. Boom. Veggies. Okay. Uh, lemon isn't a veggie. At least, I don't think it is. And isn't a tomato a fruit? God, Mike. Idiot. Uh, uh, for, oh, okay. <laughs> Mike. Mike, I got a great game. Come on, Mike. <laughs> Come on, Mike. Here, boy. Come on. Come on, boy. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Oh, you wanted to go to the basement. You know what? You want to make it creepy, Mike? Let's make it creepy. Oh, Mike. Oh, you've been lifting. Let's turn off all these lights. Mike, I can't stop you. I really can. I really can. Okay? There. Go. Damn it. Shut up, Mike! Let me just turn off the lights here. There. Okay? There. You happy? Uh, yes, Mike. I know how it works. I actually did one of these in real life. It wasn't... Actually, nothing crazy happened, so, I mean, whatever. <laughs> Do you want us to leave? Both of us are supposed to put our hands on this, Mike. Not just you. How do I know you're not moving it, Mike? I don't even know what you said. 
What was my question? <laughs> Well, Mike, my hands aren't on it, so couldn't be moving it. Yeah, give us a sign. Freak me the hell out. Go ahead. What? You just left me? Damn you, Mike. You're a piece of shit. You're a real mick asshole. You know that? I couldn't see. I don't have a flashlight. I don't have a gun. I don't have a cross or holy water. Oh, the energy. Oh, you cross your legs. I love it. The asparagus. Jeez. Season these with, ah, uh, yes. The cocoa beans need to be blended into the sauce with a little bit of vinegar. Gotta keep that fancy flavor in there. The I'm not even gonna respond. I'm just gonna let this one go. We, we gotta inject it with a little anesthesia to make sure it doesn't revolt against us it gets very angry once it knows we're trying to cook it yeah i know i have to do both our plates what what do you want me to do there every time there we go oh messages there's someone underneath your bed I can't walk slow, Mike. That's the third time. If this were real life, I would have knocked you unconscious. You, that would have been the end of you. You would have been a ghost in this house. You would have been talking to me through the Ouija board. I gotta go to the basement and hide. This is gonna end well. I don't think that's Mike. Something tells me that's not Mike. Huh? Oh! <laughs> Two grown ass adults play hide and seek. Woohoo! Close my eyes. He's probably upstairs where I hid before. Found you! I know what's gonna happen. It's actually going to be someone. I know what's gonna happen. I get it. Turn that crap off. Oh, here we go. There we go. There we go. Mike, why do I have to be by myself? Can't see again. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's just a cat. Y'all see that bottom one? Looks like you aren't the only pussy in the house. <laughs> Push in the backyard. See, that's less scary. Oh, I am. <laughs> I didn't know I was hiding. <laughs> This is so boring. Oh, I got it. Oh God, we gotta do this again. Ah! That wasn't even that scary. <laughs> I didn't scream that time. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, that's good. Okay. Yeah, so, here, so why are you here again? I'm fixing the faucet. You got a problem with that. You should have told us. I can leave. It's no problem. I can get my money back. I'm, I mean, I'm cool with that. Exactly. <laughs> Have you fixed money faucets before? Well, yeah. Huh. Isn't this late for you? Uh. Yes, I am. I'm kind of glad Mike's here, not gonna lie. Ain't no cops here. What are you talking about? Have a nice day. We're not going to see the end of him. We debated what to do. We agreed that there was something off about Rick from the start. It seemed like he enjoyed making excuses to come over unannounced. In the end, we decided Rick was weird but probably harmless. We attributed his behavior to extreme lack of social awareness. Okay, let's just enjoy ourselves, Mike. By this time, I was feeling already tired. I decided to get some rest. Goodness gracious. Here's 
But you're standing outside my- Okay, who's the bad guy? Is it the hiker? The hitchhiker? The crazy guy with the hammer? Or you? Mike? How many times I gotta tell you? You have your own bedroom. I have mine. Distance. Okay? It's the secret to any happy relationship. <laughs> Let me just go and listen to this voicemail real quick. Guys? I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killing Eva, Eva, there's a sign by the side of me. the road. It's hard to see. I, I think it says Kent Pond. The snow is like half a foot deep, and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? You're not going to leave me alone in this house by myself. Are you kidding me? <laughs> No, nah, no, nah, Mike, you're not gonna give me a hug, okay? Drive safe, Mike. Love you, Mike. Mwah. Secretly. Of course, I'm gonna get back on the right, and I'm gonna get terrified. I know what's gonna happen. Of course, someone's at the door. I can't see who it is. Oh, you're the, you're the creepy guy. It's nice to see you. How you doing? No, thank you. <laughs> I'm in a bad spot. Oh! I'm not a bitch! Back at the pizza joint. It's the hiker. I know it is. It's the hiker, I guarantee you. Oh god, everybody says that. I'm gonna go back up here, and I'm gonna go hide in here. What? Karma's a bitch. I went up here so quick. <laughs> okay. Mama! Yeah, something's going on. Okay, let's call Rick. Please, Rick, come and save us. Oh, God, we're at the door again? Yes, 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 yes. Hey! Whew! So glad you're here, Rick. Okay. What does that mean? You should be back soon. I want to respond. Where are you go? Where are you going? Fantastic. This isn't Rick. Woo. <laughs> okay. God. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Thanks for coming by. I'm gonna confront you, you bitch. And you. Fantastic. No! Eh. I died! Okay, let's try this again. Maybe if I don't confront him. Oh, no matter what I say. Okay. Come on. There we go. Don't know how to. Hey. All right, I give up. 
Obviously, that's what I need to do. I know what he's going to do. He's going to go to the door. He's going to unlock it. Then I got to go out. I know what's going to happen. Okay, I'll see you guys next time. Jesus. I don't talk about what's on the ride. They're pitching me up on the mic, spitting what I like. I've been reminiscing on friends I'm missing. And maybe I can find them if they're still in my distance.